Hey guys, Lewis here from Slim Mag, and today I'm going to be showing you the retention on my Slim Mag product. Uh, I've had a few questions and concerns about uh, what the retention is like on this product, and I haven't really went too in depth on it. I showed it a little bit on my first uh, 40 second little promo video that I put together. Um, just showed it what it was like on the belt, jiggling around, and you know the retention was good on that. But I didn't go too in depth into it, and seeing that obviously it's a valid concern, and uh, it's definitely something you want to make sure that uh, uh, is going to be firm on any kind of product like this, because you don't want your magazine falling out of out of your Kydex carriers. That is not good. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to test out the retention on it and show you exactly what it's like. Alrighty, so I've got the magazine in the Slim Mag right now. We're going to test it out. First and foremost, I want to let you know this is an Airsoft mag. Um, like I've stated in my previous videos, real steel mags and Airsoft mags fit exactly the same in here. Uh, in fact, I did this test not too long ago uh, with a friend of mine with a real steel uh, 30 round 5.56 mag in here. The retention was exactly the same. It fit exactly the same, so uh, if you're wondering what the fit is like between Airsoft and real steel, it's exactly the same. So let's get on with it. Um, my hand's probably a blur right now, but I am putting quite a bit of force into it. Count. Still no jiggling. All right, well, as you can see there, let me uh, just see if it slipped out any. It slipped out about a few centimeters and that's it. I was putting a lot of force into it right there uh, and it didn't really slip out at all. It took a lot of force to even get it to come out about two centimeters. And even then that's you know what you're gonna get in pretty much any carrier. Uh, but anyway, that is the honest truth of the Slim Mag uh, AR Mag carrier. That is the retention on it. That's the way it's gonna be again on both Real Steel and Airsoft. Uh, it's gonna be exactly the same. So anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you later, bye.